What we did is a first test of Erik Verlinde's new theory of gravity. We tested his theory by observing the distribution of gravity around galaxies using weak gravitational lensing. Weak gravitational lensing works because, as Einstein taught us, gravity is nothing more than the curvature of space-time. And as the light of distant galaxies travels through this curved space-time, we see their images through our telescopes bent. These bent images allow us to reconstruct the gravitational force around foreground galaxies up to a distance that is a hundred times larger than the galaxies themselves. The telescope that we used is ESO's Very Large Survey Telescope in Chile, which is currently performing the Kilo Degree Survey. Using this survey, we were able to measure the distribution of gravity around more than 33,000 galaxies. Usually we explain this gravity by assuming that each galaxy has a dark matter cloud of a certain mass. This time we also compared our data to the new theory of gravity by Erik Verlinde. Our results show that Verlinde's new theory can also explain the distribution of gravity around galaxies without introducing any free parameters or invisible particles. This does not mean that we can completely exclude dark matter, because there are still many observations that Verlinde's theory cannot yet explain. However, it is a very exciting and promising first step.